This is how much dating has changed in my lifetime. Man, I remember those early dates. You'd invite a woman out, maybe go to the movies, with your hands to touch, reaching for some popcorn, put your arm around her, make that move, you know. A little bit of human contact to see if there was a spark. If things went well, you'd luckily get that kiss at the door, and then you'd wait a day or two, give her a call, hopefully the next day, maybe two days, just to be hard to get, get a second date, and hope it progresses from there. Nowadays, though, it's a whole different game. I wanted to go see a movie that was only playing in a theater, so I decided to ask some people. Every woman that I asked had the same answer. I'm like, hey, what you doing? Would you like to go to a movie? I'd like to go see this movie. And they say, James, you don't got to take me out. Just come over to the house. We'll just bang one out on the couch. I'm like, no, I, I really want to see this movie. Uh, would you like to go to the movie with me? We'll have a good time. Have a good evening. They reply, no, honey, you don't need to take me out. You don't need to spend no money on me. Just come on over. You know, we'll just get freaky. We'll do it right there on the floor, laundry room. You know, we do whatever kink you want, honey. Just come on. I'll, I'll do all the dirty things you like. I'm like, no, I really just want to go to a movie. Can we please just go to a movie? I could really use the fresh air in a night out. Woman replies, oh, if you want some fresh air, come on over. We'll just hammer one out in the backyard. It'll be all right. So I ended up going to the movies by myself. And uh, I guess at least it was half price. <laughs>